Black History Month on Voice of America, acknowledging the talent, passion, and creativity of record breakers whose achievements have amazed and inspired others. Quincy Jones, a living legend in American entertainment, winner of 27 Grammy Awards and 79 Grammy nominations, more than any artist ever. And that doesn't even scratch the surface of his contributions to American culture. The grandson of a Mississippi slave, Quincy Jones was born on Chicago's South Side, but when he was 10 years old, his family moved to the West Coast of the United States, where his love of music began with trumpet lessons. At age 15, he formed a band and soon after was composing and arranging music. As a young man, Jones toured with Dizzy Gillespie, arranged music for Count Basie and Duke Ellington, and while making a name for himself among music legends, Jones landed a job at Mercury Records, eventually becoming the first African-American executive in a white-owned record company. In the 60s and 70s, Jones added social activism to his repertoire, actively supporting civil rights icons Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and Jesse Jackson. And Quincy Jones' star continued to rise in the 80s. Producer of the best-selling album in history, Michael Jackson's Thriller. Conductor and producer of the best-selling single of all time, We Are the World. Executive producer and composer of Steven Spielberg's acclaimed film, The Color Purple. Jones' social activism hasn't waned over the years, and in 1995, he won the Gene Herschelt Academy Award for his outstanding contributions to humanitarian causes. In 2001, Jones was awarded the prestigious Kennedy Center Honor in Washington, D.C. for his contributions to the cultural fabric of the United States. And in 2013, Quincy Jones receives one of American music's highest honors, his place in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Voice of America recognizes the artist, executive, entrepreneur, and humanitarian, an iconic record breaker in black history, Quincy Jones.